It's that time of year again, when all earthly inhabitants incessantly play that one Christmas song from Mariah Carey, and when the Spotify wrapped memes come out in abundance. It's my job as appointed memeologist to answer and catalog these answers. But what is Spotify wrapped? And why now? Well, Spotify Wrapped is an annual analysis of a user's music listening history, which is created and released every year. It displays what kind of music you listen to most in terms of genres, artists, and podcasts, and use them to provide insights on your personality. Spotify Wrapped has spawned various different memes over its long-running history. Spotify Wrapped originally started in 2015 as Year in Music, which was a combination of all user statistics to show favorite artists and songs from that year. In 2016, they released Spotify Wrapped wrapped, which was the beginning of the annual personalized statistics. Wrapped especially began to take off in 2017, with many users posting their personalized results. And this is when the memes started to take off. Some were annoyed with how many were sharing the results, while others poked fun at the odd genre names used in their rap, such as Downtrap and Indie Poptimism. And more recently, Bubble Grunge. At the same time, Spotify wrapped parodies really took off, such as this edited picture of one person listening to 311 687 minutes of Africa by Toto, or this one calling a user out for listening to only Crazy Frog. I personally have Mambo No. 5 by Lou Bega playing at all times. In 2020, Spotify released a new statistic, Top Fans, which allowed users to see if they were in the top percentage of their most streamed artists. One of the first to poke fun at this was Twitter user at Rubiness, who photoshopped this particular image, which... uh... Yeah, we're gonna move on. Currently, the Spotify wrapped meme season is very much in session, with many poking fun at this graphic included in their results. Many users were making fun of the way the top genres is designed. I don't know much about graphic design, but this definitely looks... Uh, jarring. Other memes have spawned ranging from making fun of Apple Music users who don't get the same sort of personalized results, to commentary on how Spotify is making private data collection more trendy. Others poke fun at themselves and what their tastes reveal about them, while some poke fun at the very cringy fellow kids language used in the Spotify wrapped graphics. Well, I hope that wrapped things up. <laughs> I'm very lonely up here. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you run across any interesting Spotify memes, I'd love to see them. As always, have a great day.